Well, baby boomers, it's your fault. No, it's not all your fault. But today on the National Real Estate Cafe, we are going to address why we've had a lack of inventory over the last 10 years and why we may still, maybe call it five, and what we're going to still potentially have a lack of inventory over the next two to three years and maybe as long as five as well. So let's take a look at this article here. It says, baby boomers are the key to fixing housing's imbalance. Uh, unfortunately, what this article is asking you to do is die. That's not very cool. Um, but the reality is that we have a multitude of reasons why we don't have enough inventory in the marketplace. So one of them is baby boomers are healthier, longer, and they're aging in place. Um, they've uh, not all to their own fault. Good One good thing is that maybe they've saved enough. Maybe they had enough wealth. Prior other generations used to put people in aging homes, and now boomers are able to age in place better than they ever have. So that keeps people in their homes. Now, add one layer to that is that during the housing crisis, we lowered interest rates so low that affordability is a key factor, and boomers were able to refinance in the threes, and that's also allowing them to financially stay in those homes. We did an article on that a long time ago in a show on that called Trapped. Uh, so these people are trapped in their homes as well, not allowing them to move or downsize because it doesn't make any sense because they have such a great interest rate on their home. Add another layer to that. You could say it's the millennials' fault because they don't want to buy the properties. That's not true. Millennials are just broke. It took them 10 years later to start their life and to start their financial uh, wherewithal, so to speak, than it did for most of us because of where they were in the Great Recession. Right when they were coming out of college, right when they were coming out of high school, right when they became of working age, they couldn't really get jobs. Uh, there wasn't good jobs. And so they're just today becoming successful and able to buy homes, creating an inventory shortage today and not a few years ago. So let's go back to the screen. Uh, you know, we'd like to blame it all on the baby boomers, we'd like to blame it all on the millennials. Shoot, yeah, you could say the fiscal stimulus, you can blame some of it on the Fed, some of it on Obama, but the reality of the matter is it's nobody's fault. It's just a perfect storm of events that has made uh, this market that we're in today a little bit of a stalemate, still missing on inventory, and builders are working on that quickly. So in the next few years, builders will bring inventory to market, our demographic population continues to expand, and uh, everything should be fine and dandy in the next few years. But right now, there's still an inventory shortage. So if you're a seller, take advantage today before a lot of that inventory comes to market on the National Real Estate Cafe. Check this out on your phone by get it, texting NREC to the number 58885.